Hey guys, it's Gaming Gaming here, and I'm doing another video. This video is a challenge, and I think this is going to turn into a bit of a trend. And this is quite cool. Basically, popular YouTubers like KSI and PewDiePie, etc., say a lot of word fills such as um, uh, we like stuff like that, like weird stuff. Um, like that. That's a good example. But they always edit it out. But smaller YouTubers like my channel, they don't edit it out. So, this is what I'm trying to do. I, I am allowed to stutter because it's quite hard talking for 20 minutes without a word filled. And um, let's just see how long I'll survive. Let's get into the video. So I'm going to start off the video as me talking to you about vlogs. Now, I am subscribed to a lot of vlogs channel, s channels, such as Pointless Vlogs, um, that's one, PewDiePie, and I think, like, KSI does vlog, surely, and like, Com Comedy Shorts Gamer, so that sort of stuff. And I have thought that I could do my own vlog channel. So that would be quite cool in a way. And I'll be vlogging every single thing. What I'll be doing for the video stuff. If that makes any sense. Like just a day in a life with Toby. Gaming Gaming. And I'll just be showing you all the videos that I'll be doing soon. And that's vlogs done, really. And my next thing that I'll be talking to you about is films. Now, there are a lot of films coming out, such as Civil War, Angry Birds, X-Men Apocalypse. And I think... They're the only good ones which are... Oh, The Big Friendly Giant. And I think that they're the only ones which are coming out. Also, about films. I've got Netflix, which I've had for around about two years now. And it's got so much to out. There's tons of films what you'll enjoy. And I just love Netflix, but not the chill part, if you know what I'm trying to say. So, that's two. I've done quite well though. Two in two minutes. That is quite good. My next thing that I'll be talking about is football. Now, I'm a Liverpool supporter. We lost in the fucking final. I am pissed off. All of that Dortmund stuff, it just went down the bloody drain. Literally, we just beat. All the teams until we got to the final, and then we just fucked up at the end. And they weren't even the hardest team in the competition, and we even defeated the hardest team. And they were mental. They they were literally they are Royce and a Bamiang. I mean, it it just pisses me off how we lost. I don't. I'm actually speechless. I mean, Liverpool used to be so good, and then they played like Lucas Lavia, who hasn't scored since two thousand fucking nine. He's only scored one goal for Liverpool, and he's been there for ages. I mean, how shit can you get? I mean, Klopp's really happy that he beat his old club, but what the fuck? It's just, it's just pisses me off so much. But um, that's three. But Brighton. My other team I support, my local team, they were flipping two goals away, two or three goals from getting promoted to the top league of England, the uh, the Barclays Cup, whatever you want to call it. But we're still in the Championship, aka the Sky Bet Cup, whatever, whatever you want to call it. But it is what it is, and I really, 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 really can't complain but I have to complain because it's my team but Brighton had an outstanding season their manager got ma manager award which is really really good for Brighton and they only recently got promoted like two years ago 
So they were going to get promoted again, but we did come third in the table, which is really, really good. And that is, I'm really happy with that. But they used to do the top three getting promoted, but they have to do the bloody playoffs now, which is so annoying. But um, I've also, I I play football as well, so um, I play for uh, one of my local teams, New Haven FC. And you guys are probably watching right now. Shout out to you guys. It's a really good club. A lot of people are left to go to other teams, but I don't care. They're just scrub lords. <laughs> and then we have like group chats and that about the um the football club that's four. I said um that one didn't count because I was just saying. Okay, so we're on five minutes and fifteen minutes to go. So so far I have said about vlogs, films and football stuff. And now I'll be talking to you about other channels. Now, on YouTube, I have subscribed to a lot of different channels, such as KSI, Good Mythical Mornings, PewDiePie, BuzzFeeds, can't remember what colours though, and what other ones... football ones I think there's one called like Rizza or something I can't remember but they're all really good channels and they actually influence me to do these sort of videos which I really enjoy and I just love doing YouTube and I got 1000 views on one of my videos which I'm really really chuffed about and nearly 200 views with the video I think that was a crossbar challenge with Ollie. But the one with Spencer just only reached 100 views, which is still increasing, which I'm quite happy about. Okay, let's move on to the next thing. It's about school. Now, school. School. There you go, guys. That's it. That's what I can say about school. No, I'm joking. Um... That's five. It's really shit school. I hate it. Boring. Just, I know it will get me like a job and that, but I just hate the people in my school. Not all of them, but some of them, and you know who I'm talking about. And GTSCs are coming around the corner soon, which is going to really, really piss me off. And I've already got one next month about um that's seven because i said it twice about uh that's eight about bend it like beckham well that no bend it like beckham is all right it's a bit boring but it has a it's really cheesy and it's not taken ser seriously and it's a it's a really good film that's nine I think um that's ten it's about uh that's eleven it's about David Beckham just how a girl from I think it's like Indian and English like you know like put together like someone you know like half so like half Indian half English girl um that's 12 i think 12 uh 13 has been influenced by david beckham who is a english footballer to play football and it's just showing her story about how she um that's 14 how she goes her way from doing football and her family tries to stop her but they literally just tell her do what you want to do in life and that's what she did and then she just went to America with her friend and it's in the right film but I have to, I have to do it for GCSE and I really can't be bothered but I have to I'm also doing superhero films as well and superhero films are right 
No right, but we need to analyse a clip from it, which is gonna be so hard media. But at the start in year nine, it is so fun. It literally is. It's like the funnest thing ever because you can literally just go around filming stuff around school, well, around your school, and um, that's sixteen, I think, fifteen, sixteen. I'll say fifteen. And you can just watch tons of films, and that's it really. You you just watch films in year nine and make your own stuff. But you do start your coursework. But mine's been sent off as it's, I think the date is something in, what's the date? I forgot what the bloody month is now. I'll just say it's May, but I don't know. I, I, I've actually forgotten. My, my brain just got funny. And we have reached halfway. Now, let's move on to other challenges. So... The other challenges I might be well I've done my one hundred and fifty subscriber special so you should know about them challenges but I haven't got I'm not gaining a lot of subs really quickly compared to other channels are which is annoying but I'm I am grateful for what I've got so far and I do want to increase my views, my subscribe my subscribes what my subscribers and like counts and that will be amazing really but the challenges what you guys have given me they are really really hard and they just I, I don't even know how to get them really because I don't even know if my parents will even let me buy the stuff what you, what you requested, if you know what I'm trying to say. And it's, it's going to be really hard and challenging, but I think the maximum what I can do in a video is a football video until I get to, say, three, 300 subs, and then I'll carry on doing what you request with like, your challenges and stuff. And that would be sick. Okay. So that's challenge stuff. And now I have to literally... That's the only thing what I've written down. <sighs> There's nothing else to talk about though. That's the thing. Like To do a video, you need to be prepared of what you're trying to do. But I've literally come prepared in six categories or six subjects which I don't even have anymore literally like I've, I've literally just used them up and now I'm just free roaming my words if that makes any sense just getting stuff up the top of my brain and try not to use any word fills the storage is going up mentally <laughs> hopefully it won't like break down on me because of the storage but my recent what the hell my recent videos have been quite good i hope you guys have enjoyed that fox video I got like 15 likes which is quite a lot and thank you for that guys and thanks for the comments guys and girls i'm sorry <laughs> and the uh, comments are just whipping in which i appreciate that from different channels and I I literally just can't think how amazing my YouTube channel is sometimes because I've got that YouTube studio thing which is on I don't I don't know if it's in the app store or the I know it's on the uh the Google store whatever it's called the um the Play Store, but I don't I, I don't know if it's on the uh, on Apple devices, but I've literally just looked at statistics of people who view my channel and what they are, and there are people, but there are quite a lot of people between the ages of eight to around about thirty, 
But there are people older than 30, which is a little bit freaky. But it's a view, it's a view. And I haven't put any locations down. So they can't, so they don't know where I live, which is a very, very good thing. Which I'm quite happy about, and I have no idea why I'm flicking this pen around. Also, I have been looking at tra traffic sources, which is how people get to my channel and subscribe to it. And mostly they subscribe to me by searching up my YouTube channel. Um, wait, what's that? That's 17 now. I think, I think that's 17. Yes, yeah, searching up my YouTube channel and searching, well, yes, yeah, searching it up on YouTube, searching up on the internet, and I think from links as well, or Facebook or Twitter, if you follow me on that, I normally do share my videos, and then you just subscribe when watch my videos as there's a, my subscription logo in my videos. But you guys should actually do this challenge. is is actually harder than you think, and it's. I don't know if you would class it as a waste of time, or fun because I know you guys wouldn't watch this for twenty minutes unless if you're an absolute sado or anything like that. But <sighs> when I get my old gato working. I'll be doing a lot of stuff. I mean, I've already done one video on my Elgato. And I do a lot and a lot of thumbnails. I, I do it for literally every video of mine. I even did, I even did it to the Fox ones. I did it to... Um, that's 18. I even did it to the... That's 20, or 21, I can't remember, I'll, I'll just say it's 21. I did it to the Call of Duty one, which I made ages ago, which I really, really enjoyed, and I love making them sort of videos. But that one was not by an Elgato, that was by the Theatre of Black Ops 2. And that was when... But back then, that was when it was working, but I don't think it, it doesn't work for me anymore, which is annoying. Jesus, this is this video is on 2000 megabytes, and I've only been recording for 17 minutes. Three more minutes to go, and then the video is over. Thank god, I've never been so eager to finish off a video. No offence guys, <laughs> there's not much to talk about, I mean, I've I've got a lot of Xbox games, I bought a new game, I'll show you that, there's, there's nothing else to talk about, I've actually got up from my seat for the first time in the video, so if you ever shop at this company called Kex or whatever you want to call it, or if you're sick minded, yeah, you get the joke. I got this game for 250 as I'm still on Xbox 360 and it's still B. Shout out to my friends who play Xbox 360. And this game is called Enslaved Odyssey to the West and I got it for £2.50. It's a really good game, it's about. Um, that's 23, I think. It's about the survivors who survived this, like, this zombie thing. Well, it's not like zombies, but the scenery of the city and that is, like, all zombie-looking. If to say, like, if you ever watched The Walking Dead, you would know what I'm talking about. When you look at the city, it's all, like, mouldy and not what it is and all isolated and like a ghost town so that's literally what it's like and then there's robots living in the city now and I've quit FIFA because of Jan Chapman 
He literally just mugged me off at FIFA. And I've given up on FIFA. It's, it just doesn't make any sense because I just tackle and tackle and tackle. And it doesn't actually do anything. And I've tried my hardest to try and tackle. And it still doesn't do it. And sometimes the passes don't even make it to people. And that makes me mad. And then they score from that afterwards. Or they score long shots, which are stupid. So now I am playing Pez. I'm not the only one who plays it on Xbox now. Literally, I go on an online game and there is no one playing at all. But I got the pre-ordered version like right now when it came out in September. And it is a really, really good game. I do prefer it to FIFA now. But... I still do like FIFA 15, just not 16 that much. And come on, 20 minutes. And I only did 22. Yes. We did it. We did it. We did it. I got 22 erms. Um, that's quite good in a video. Come on, guys. That is quite good. Oh, well, th thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have been watching the whole thing, which I doubt very much. I've literally just been trash talking the whole time. So, um, thanks guys. See you in the next video. Bye.